Hey everybody, Daniel Rubino here with Windows Phone Central. I just want to give you guys a quick look here at the new Nokia Call SMS block feature. If we head into settings, if I can launch that, there we go, we scroll all the way down, you're going to see it pops up there under all of Nokia's other apps. So how do you get this? You need two things. You need GDR2, aka Windows Phone 8 build 10.327 or later. So that's the Nokia Lumia 1020 and the Nokia Lumia 925. And if any of you fancy guys who flashed your device with some of those uh, leaked ROMs should be able to do this. But you also need to go to the uh, Nokia store there and download the extras and info update. Once you update that, restart the device and you should see this little section here pop up. So this is an AT&T 1020 and it's working fine. Also International Lumia 925s should have it as well. And we have confirmed that. Uh, launching into it is actually really nice. So you get to call SMS filter name here. Block calls and SMS is on. You have block numbers. You have a little chart here showing how many calls and SMS you have. So you just hop into block numbers here and then you can uh, presumably populate that. So apparently do it directly from call history, which is kind of interesting and convenient actually. Uh, under advanced, these are some pretty nice tools here. So uh, block withheld numbers. I'm not really sure what that means, but uh, app live tile. So that's kind of cool. And there it goes, it creates a live tile. Well, look at that, isn't that fancy? Go back into advanced and notifications. Get notifications about blocked calls and SMS, which is pretty awesome. Now, if you're wondering how this has been done, it's partly Nokia's responsibility, obviously. They are the ones who did this, but it was actually because Microsoft enabled the APIs in Windows Phone 8 GDR2. So OEMs could go through and create their own applications to do this. Nokia was the first one, obviously, to go ahead and do that. So there you go. Like I said, you're going to need two things here, GDR2 and the Extras and Info Update, which just came out today. Doing so, we start the device, and you should see this new call SMS filter. It does not appear to be carrier dependent, so this should be uh, pretty much good for everyone to go. But that's a really huge feature that a lot of people have been asking for for a very long time, so we're very excited to see it. Anyways, head to Windows Phone Central for more information. Take care, everybody.